Before watching the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button below and clicking the bell icon to be notified whenever we publish a new video. I bet that lately you must have heard a lot about curcuma or turmeric, right? In these recent years, it became the ideal medicine for all kinds of issues and has been since considered the holy grail of health for many people. Even though it is largely consumed in Asian countries, curcuma is still not very well known in the Occident. However, it is most commonly used as a spice or tea. Even though it doesn't do much for weight loss, curcuma has amazing benefits for our health. We even made a video about it on our channel. Click to watch it and learn more about this powerful root. Today you will know what good curcuma brings to our body, according to science. Fights viral diseases. Curcumin is a compound found on curcuma, and it is great to fight some viruses, like herpes or flu. Making a tea with this root is a great alternative to get rid of the flu. Depression. According to some studies, curcuma can help in cases of depression, being considered even more efficient than some medicines to treat this disorder. If you want to learn more, click on the video being suggested to you right now. Helps type 2 diabetes. One of the main properties of curcuma is to fight inflammation. Did you know that? According to a study done in 240 adults that supplemented curcuma for 9 months, it helps keep the blood glucose levels stable, reducing the chances of developing the disease. Reduces the risks of Alzheimer's Alzheimer's is nothing more than a chronic inflammation. According to studies, curcuma fights inflammation, so it is highly recommended as a natural medicine to prevent Alzheimer's. But when we talk about treating the disease, the evidence is still scarce and the root can't be considered as a fighting agent against the disease. High cholesterol. As with depression, the results are mixed. Some studies showed that the root can reduce the levels of LDL, the bad cholesterol, in blood. In other studies, however, the changes were almost null. Curious, isn't it? Now we can only wait for the next studies to prove if this root that has an intense color is efficient to fight high cholesterol. Have you ever used curcuma for one of these issues? What are your opinions about it? If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more recipes and tips, subscribe to the channel.